Matt Hill for the call of the great race tonight. Growing Empire, Kamochi, I wish I win. Good pipe opener in the Moya. And Johnny Rocker are going to be the final four. Johnny Rocker running a blinder, of course, in the William Reed earlier in the year behind the great Imperatrice. Kamochi to join them. I wish I win moves forwards for yet another Group 1 assignment for him. Growing Empire, Craig Williams has won the race twice. And Johnny Rocker are going to be the final two. Tote favourites is Growing Empire at 370. I wish I win $5 and Hayasugi at $5.20. Here's Johnny Rocker, Ben Mallum for Nick Ryan to complete the line. Johnny Rocker, the final one forwards. As they just work a little here with Growing Empire, who's just a little bit reluctant. Big occasion for the three-year-old. So the gate's being cleared. Johnny Rocker going into the stalls. The field is set. Group one, in front of a big crowd at the valley. Starter glances over the line. They're ready, Sickle racing in the Matacado. Johnny Rocker missed the start, three lengths. Climbing Star going back to second last. Estriella fired out with Growing Empire, followed by Cabalas recommendation. Next in the field, Coleman got to fifth on the inside of Kamochi Hayasugi. A length and a half, V8 Southport Tycoon. Towards the end, I wish I win. Climbing Star and Johnny Rocker. Estriella, 800 metres to go. Burning Rubber leading by about a length and a half. Growing Empire second, two and a quarter. Cabalas outside of recommendation. A length and a half Kamochi Hayasugi, six off the lead between horses. Then came Coleman next the inside, fizzed up from V8 Southport Tycoon. Next climbing star, I wish I win and Johnny Rocker last. Estriella trying to give her a breather before the corner. At the 400 metres from Growing Empire, who's a half length away stoked up. A length and a half Kabbalist recommendation behind those Hayasugi Coleman. Into the straight it's Estriella at the 200 metres. Growing Empire won't go away, followed by recommendation. Growing Empire took the front. 100 metres to go from Estriella. Then Southport Tycoon. Growing Empire is in front holding on. Southport Tycoon lunch but missed I reckon. Growing Empire I'd say from Southport Tycoon it will be a photo. They were followed by a wall of them. Estriella behind them got tired. Climbing star Coleman and Kamochi. Then I wish I win recommendation. Hayasugi, Johnny Rocker. Behind those horses then was V8 and Kabalis at the end of the fields. Oh! Outsiders got it right on the line. Southport Tycoon. <laughs> Kira Mars, Quinella the race, but it's a boil over. Southport Tycoon, we spoke to Kieran Lizzie pre-race. He said, I've targeted this race and the question will be asked, did Craig just for a moment think he had the race with Growing Empire? Did he just for a stride sit up a touch and Southport Tycoon nailed him on the line? Well, Southport Tycoon certainly nailed him on the line. That was an inch perfect ride there. We've seen Mark Zara pull out some amazing performances in the past and that has to be one of the very best. We could see he was back in the field, good speed as we would have envisaged in this type of race and he was absolutely hutch growing wings over those concluding stages and just nailed a very, very gallant growing empire on the line. Yeah, it was an amazing fish, a few talking uh, points and we're going to talk about the growing empire. We've seen him uh, sort of uh, you know, stop pretty quick in front where a couple of starts back but let's hear from the winning rider. What a ride it was as well, uh, right up the inside. Let's head out to Charlotte. Yeah, well, just that uh, these cars.